Well, the Bulls really are on Broadway today. The Professional Bull Riders Tour is in town for a special competition right in Times Square. The tour has grown from just eight events to now 400, making it a $100 million business. Our Michelle Steele is in the thick of it all. She joins us now live. Michelle? Hey, Margaret, good morning. Yes, I am here with a guy who knows a little bit something about bulls. He's Jeffrey Pollock. He's executive chairman of the Professional Bull Riders, and they do have an event today at 1 p.m. in Times Square, the first time, actually, that you guys have come to Times Square. So welcome to the show. Now, the first thing I want to ask you is you are from the World Series of Poker, another sport that's experienced uh, quite a bit of growth in the last decade. How, what are you going to do now for the world for uh, PBR? You know, how are you going to make that more of a mainstream sport? The PBR is really a brand that's on the move. We have a traditional, um, uh, very authentic brand and heritage, but we're now modernizing the presentation of that brand and now being more aggressive in getting our, our message out. So our goal right now and our business plan going forward is called PBR 2.0. Uh, we're really trying to get more people to appreciate how special and extraordinary this sport is. Sure. You know, in 2008, I know the former head of PBR, Randy Mark Bernard, said, uh, that there are $24 million worth of corporate sponsorships. Clearly, since then, the economy has struggled somewhat. Where are sponsorships right now? Actually, we're doing very nicely in sponsorships. We've held our base uh, well during the uh, economic downturn, which says something about the value that we offer. And we do offer an extraordinary value to sports marketers. And now our job is to get uh, more sports marketers to appreciate just how unique this brand is. You know, uh, Two of your broadcast partners, NBC and Versus, are essentially merging. As someone, you know, what does that mean for, for you guys, for the guys that actually get those license fees when two of them are getting together? Well, we just renewed our deal with Versus for another year, so we're going to continue to be on Versus through uh, the, the 2011, 2011. season. Uh, and we also just took our production essentially in-house starting next year. And on top of that production, we've uh, put David Neal, uh, former executive producer of NBC Sports, as our new executive producer. So we're very focused on reinventing our TV coverage, and we're going to do that with Versus and with David next year. Great. And finally here, very quick question. We were talking about investing in bulls in the next hour. Uh, given what the stock market's been like in the, in the last year, what's a safer investment? Stocks or <laughs> PBR, definitely stock. Uh, as I said, we're a brand on the move. Uh, we just hired a new chief marketing officer, Dockery Clark. Uh, we're revitalizing our team, and we're professionalizing more than ever before how this sport is presented. So uh, I think we're a great investment going forward. Great. Thanks, Jeffrey. Thank you. Sounding bullish on bulls this morning, and that's the latest from PBR in Times Square. Margaret, back over to you. So, Michelle, quick question. If, if someone goes to Times Square today, can they actually get on a bull? Jeffrey, if someone goes to Times Square today at 1 p.m., can they get on a bull? No. The uh, answer is no. no. You've got to be a professional. No. <laughs> All right. For, Mar for you, Margaret, maybe. Oh, see, I wanted to see you up there, Michelle.